Some of history's greatest works of literature, music, and art exist because of patrons, men and women who gave artists financial resources, encouragement, and support. Without a doubt, many priceless paintings, sculptures, books, and symphonies would not exist without these people. The same is true in the history of the church. If Frederick III hadn't supported Luther financially and protected him from Rome, the Protestant Reformation may never have happened. Without the partnership of Humphrey Monmouth, a wealthy merchant, William Tyndale probably doesn't translate the Bible into English and ignite the Reformation in the English church. History is full of people like that, humble men and women who support the proclamation of God's word. I want to introduce you to dear friends of mine who are modern day examples of that kind of patronage. Over the last 30 years, this family and the foundation they established has been working behind the scenes, supporting, encouraging, providing resources so that expository preaching and sound theology can spread across the globe.